Good morning, skiers and riders. Sugarloaf and Carabasset Valley. Time to take a check of your latest local forecast. You can find this and much more at our website, WSKITV.com, along with our streaming services as well. And this brought to you by Mountainside Real Estate. We'll see cloudy skies today. Could see a few flurries out there. It'll be mild, 34 to 36 at the base, 25 to 27 at the summit, with a light north northwest breeze. Should be hardly noticeable out there, but it may pick up a bit throughout the day as well so be aware of that saturday could start out the day with some clouds but becoming partly sunny by the afternoon 23 to 25 for your base temps summer temperatures cooler 11 to 13 and that wind noticeable from the north northwest as well for the day on saturday but should be great out there then we'll see partly sunny skies right across the board uh, partly sunny for sunday high of 26 monday partly sunny high of 27 partly sunny skies continue for tuesday with a high of 30 degrees. So those temperatures staying a little mild, but uh, at least they're below freezing for the most part. 95 trails on your Birchwood Interiors Trail Report. 49 groomed trails. Nine lifts getting you there. Machine groomed and packed powder conditions. We did receive a little bit of snow overnight, so that groomed in and will ski nicely uh, for the day today. As far as your lifts, Snubber, Skidway, and Sawduster, those mo move you around the base area and below the base area at 8.30 this morning. Skyline and Super Quad get going at 8.30 as well, and Double Runner East, too. And King Pine and Wiffle Tree, those are the east side lifts. They get going at 9 a.m. King Pine up high, Wiffle Tree down lower, and Timberline, the uppermost lift, should run today at 9 a.m. as well. Snowmakers out there, you'll notice them off Spillway Crosscut, uh, White Nitro Extension and Gondola Line Extension, so just be aware of that if you're headed east from the top of uh, Skyline. Timberline, Bridal Chain, Tote Road, Upper Double Bitter, King's Landing, Hayburner, Haywire, Skidder, Competition Hill, Spillway, Sluice, and Gondi Line on the groomers list last night. Ramdown, Hallback, Widowmaker, Flume, Wiffle Tree, Slasher, and Rollway, as well as Scoot and Horseshoe on the west side. Did hear from the groomers, and they got everything on the list last night, so that's some good news. All around the base areas, uh, groomed out as well, and the terrain parks too. Check out the new park over there on Drop Line, uh, next to Lower Winters Way, and the Sugarloaf Outdoor Center. Perfect conditions down there. Mike was grooming all night long down there. Things are in great shape, so go down there and take advantage of it. Snowshoeing and the ice rink available as well. And don't forget the Bull Moose Cafe, open every day, 9:30 to 3:30. The Carabasa Valley Fat Bike Trails are in awesome shape as well. So get out there and ride it. And don't forget, the Fat Tire Race from the Outdoor Center will be happening on the 11th. So be sure to check that out. You can uh, register online. And it's fire on the mountain all weekend long. So here's your Friday night headliner as well as some Saturday night bands that it will be playing. So be sure to take advantage and check out. Should be a great uh, weekend for live music here on the mountain. Also, check out our live quad cam so you can see exactly what's happening at the base of the mountain in real time to know before you go. Also, check us out. We are on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, as well as WSKITV.com where you can find us streaming. We're also on the Spectrum app and streaming on Roku. We've got a Roku channel, so download that. And don't forget our live mountain reports every single Saturday and Sunday morning from 7.30 to 9 a.m. with the info to know before you go. Enjoy the day, folks.